In this video, I'm going to create an affiliate marketing sales funnel for you. Let's get started. Hello YouTube, my name is Alston and welcome to my channel where I help you find different ways to make money online. Be sure to like, subscribe, and ring the bell if you want to learn different tips and tricks on how to make money online. And in this video, I am going to actually create your sales funnel. The only thing you'll need to do is you'll need to go in, click the link in the description, change the uh, text and change the colors to meet your specifications and you'll have a sales funnel that converts. So what you'll need is you'll need ClickFunnels. If you don't already have ClickFunnels, you'll actually have a two week free trial. If you click the link that, that the first link in the description, you click that link and you'll be taken to a page. If you don't have ClickFunnels, you can sign up for the two week free trial. But once you get there, um, once you sign up for the, the free trial, you'll be given this, um, you'll be able to download this sales page. But I'm actually gonna show you what I'm gonna do behind the scenes. I'm gonna create this funnel for you and you'll just be able to edit it as you need. So I'm going to choose the classic funnel and I'm going to collect emails and we're just going to call this a YouTube uh, a fun. Uh, we'll call it YouTube fun and then we're going to actually fun. We're going to um, we'll say uh, YTF and this can really be whatever you want it to be. I'm just doing this to get through it. But the cool thing with click funnels is they have a bunch of templates that are already set up. You can elect to choose them. You can elect to do something on your own. Um, basically, the way that uh, ClickFunnels is set up is it gives you an opt-in page. That's where people will come to and they'll leave their email address. And then the thank you page will either take them directly to an affiliate offer. It can be a YouTube video or it can be um, a it can also include like a, a free PDF guide that you give out. So basically what I'm going to do here is I am actually going to, um, should we create our own or should we use a template? As you can see, ClickFunnels has a number of templates that you can use. I am going to select this template here and then it downloads it. Basically the only thing you need to do is you need to change the wording. There's a thing called congruency that you'll need to um, uh, understand the concept and how that works. Basically you want it, congruency means everything looks and feels the same. So if you are taking someone, um, let's say someone clicks on a YouTube video and they click the link in the description and it takes them to this page, you want this page to be congruent with the affiliate offer that you're going to send them to. So if you are going to send them to, let's say Amazon or, or Amazon Associates to buy a product, you want it to, to have the same colors, the same look and feel as that next page so that it all makes sense and they're not surprised or caught off guard. So basically what I'm actually going to do is I'm actually going to get rid of some of this stuff because when we're doing affiliate marketing, we want a very basic page so that the, the less they have to click on, the less they have to look at, uh, the, the better because you don't want them to get distracted or confused or discouraged. We basically just want the, to collect their email and get them going to the next step. So all, the only thing you need to do is you just basically need to come in here and change this. I'm just going to put uh, a change, oops, change text. And what you could do is if you wanted to, again, I would probably just get rid of this next one here because we want, we want this to be as simple as possible. And again, we want to do a call to action, sign up for a free ebook. Um, we could say something like, uh, click, here to learn more or or leave your email leave your email address to learn more leave um, enter your email address to learn more you, again you want to keep this as basic as possible so that you don't distract them or or confuse them now there are a number of things that you can do. You can, let's say we want to change the color here. We just highlight this and then we can click this widget over here and this will give us a bunch of options on the side. If you wanted to change the color, you just, again, you click the widget or, or gear or settings, whatever you want to call it, and you can just click this and change the color. You want this to be the same color as Amazon or, or whatever affiliate offer that you're sending them to so that it's congruent, so that it makes sense and again, that people aren't caught, caught off guard. And you can do the same with all of this. You can change the background. If we, again, we click this um, gear or settings or whatever, we can change the background color if we wanted to. But again, we want this to look as, as basic as possible. Make sure that you're following along step by step so that you don't get confused or lost. 
Uh, click funnels is pretty easy. It can there it can be a little bit of a learning curve if you're not prepared. But this is basically it. You just want to keep it very simple, very basic. You can add in your flare if you wanted to. You can add in an image. Um, maybe we'll, why don't we do that? We'll click that, and then we could we could go here and add a column. Click add new element, and then here you have a whole host of op options. If you wanted to add an image, you can do that. Um, and then we can just add whatever image we want to. We can either upload an image or we can use any one of these images that are already populating. And so what I'm going to do is I am just going to, um, why don't we just upload this image? We'll say add image. And then that's what it looks like. And we can always go back and resize it to 200. And this could be your picture if you wanted it. It could be really anything. Um, it could be It could be your logo. But again, if you really wanted to, and again, you want to make this as, as basic or as simple as possible so that you're not confusing them. And again, we just move that there, and then we'll just get rid of this. Click OK. And then if we preview it, we can see what this looks like. Um, I didn't save it, but we could get an idea of what this looks like in just five or six minutes. You want to make sure you go in and you'll say um, affiliate. Because this is a website, affiliate offer you want to have some data in here that um, that will possibly show up in, in search results so if we do that we can just click save and then if we click preview it should work there we go and this is really it if you wanted to you can come down here and you can change the color uh, but you want to make sure that everything again is congruent make sure you you learn and memorize that word uh, congruent and congruency if we wanted to we could make this all red um, because we want this all to be the same color. Um, but yeah, that's really it. So you click save and then if we click exit on the top left here, we can do the same thing for our, our thank you page. Our thank you, what happens with our thank you page is uh, once someone enters in their name and their email address, they'll automatically be taken to this thank you page and the thank you page can be the the uh, uh, video, I like, actually, I like this video here. It can be a video from YouTube. It can be, um, I can have the, the email PDF guide that, that I include. It can have it right on the page here. Uh, and it can take you directly to the offer. So uh, watch this real quick and I'll show you. It takes, you know, you can get this set up in less than 10 or 15 minutes and, and, and ready to go. So basically what we would do is, first thing we're going to do is we're going to add in a YouTube video. So... Uh, let me pull up a YouTube video and everything's real easy. You just click on this um, spot here where the, the video would play. I'm just going to go over to my other screen and add my most recent video. Um, so this will be a second while that's loading up. We can change the background if we wanted to. Um, you just you have so many options that it's, it's, it's frightening and, and you have a lot of power. What we're going to do is, I'm actually going to add an element here, and we're going to add, let's add, let's add subheading here. So we're going to say, uh, click here to download your free guide. So we're going to put that there, and then we can also change the size so that people see this. Uh, font size we can make that larger and then what we can do and the cool thing with with click funnels is you can actually upload your they're called uh, digital assets you can upload your digital assets right into click funnels and then put that that um, that web address right here so um, we would just say um, we're just gonna say I'm just gonna say Alston but this would be your your link to the um, to your digital asset so we're just going to do that and then if they clicked on that it would take them to it would take them to the download their digital asset so that's actually really cool really easy I found a YouTube video that I wanted to bring over and what you can do is you can actually embed a YouTube video that's private or, or not published or you can even um, you can do a, a public thank you. It, it's really up to you. All right, so we've got that. Got that, got that. 
And then what we could do also is now that they've watched the video, we can add here in the red, we'll say, uh, take me to affiliate offer. So instead of it being an actually the affiliate offer, it would, instead of it saying, take me to affiliate offer, it could say, take me to um, whatever product or service that you're recommending. And again, here you could go click the gear, make this font size a little bit bigger. We could change the color. Uh, we can make it, let's see, we'll make it black and just make it stand out. Um, text color black. And so uh, the black and the red doesn't look great together. So we could actually just go back in here and we could change that back to white. But, and then again, this could be a link directly to whatever offer, whatever affiliate product or service that we're recommending. So I'm just going to put in here again, alstingodbolt.com. Cause I, all right. And so if we click save again, saving, save, if we click preview, as you can see, the video pops up. You'll what what you'll want to do is you'll want to say uh, watch the below video, and then maybe down below or, or somewhere else, um, you would say click here to download the free guide, and you could email them the free guide because they've joined your email list. So you could do that all at one time, and then again down here it could say take me to affiliate offer because I don't like the look of that, the red on the blue. Uh, we could go back in here and. Uh, we could change this if we wanted to change that to uh, change that to white, maybe. Mm. Do some colors. I don't really like how any of those look. All right, so we could do that. We we'll click save, and then we could click preview again. And the only thing is, is people may not realize that. Because it's white, it's an, it's an affiliate link. But the great thing about this is that you've already collected their email. Um, you know what they're interested in. And you can actually follow up with them because you have their email. And you can start the email marketing. If you know anything about me, I'm a huge proponent of email marketing. It is something that I talk about and I reference all the time. Email marketing converts at twice the rate as affiliate marketing. And you can actually follow up with people multiple times. Because if you've done any research, if you know anything about marketing, you know that it takes between 5 and 12 touch points before someone will 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 become a buyer so that's all really cool and this is all awesome because again you've got their email address and you can follow up and target with them um as many times as you want because because you have their contact information um what we could do and if we want to get even more creative we could add a pop-up and say and if someone clicks off we could say like before you go um we could say like don't leave yet or something if we'll just do a quick header here we'll say uh don't leave me um and so if someone were to exit if we click save and we go back to preview oops i probably do it too quick if i um let me go back here save that click preview I go up, should get a pop-up that says, don't leave me. Uh, it's still loading, I wonder. That's the issue. Let me just click this link here. The reason why it's not loading is because not everything is quite set up. There is some setup that you'll have to do in the background. You'll have to obviously connect a, um, you have to collect, connect a domain name to this because you are obviously going to be on the internet. But for the most part, everything is all squared away. Um, this is the only thing you need to do. Really, you get the click the link in the description. It'll take you to this page. If you don't already have ClickFunnels, you'll have to sign up. There's a two-week free trial. You sign up, you get to download this, and you just edit whatever information that you want. It's really easy. We deleted that if we wanted to, um, and so on. But yeah, this is it. Uh, make sure you click that first link in the description to get this um, this exact opt-in page. You can add and subtract whatever you want to it. I just wanted to show you how easy it is to get started with uh, email marketing. And then you can actually move on to the, to the next step.